Hey, what's up YouTube, Matt from Gold Bros. Coming to you guys in the video today. In this video, I'm going to be doing an update on this All-Star CM3000 SBT. So let you guys know I'm breaking this in for one of my followers, and uh, it's coming along really great so far. Uh, you guys can see it's starting to get a little bit of wear in the pocket, but that's completely normal. Um, out of respect for him, I'm not using this glove outside. I'm only using it when I'm in the indoor facility. Um, so that's just um, something I'm doing, you know, to try to keep it as preserved as possible. Um, so it's starting to develop nicely. Um, he is actually on a vacation right now. So when he gets back from his vacation, um, I'm actually going to be shipping it back out to him. Till then, you know, I'm just going to keep breaking it and getting it as game ready as possible. Um, to me right now, this is borderline game ready. Uh, the All-Stars don't really take a crazy long time to break in. I don't know if that's just for me or is it in general. Uh, when you watch All-Stars videos that they post, a lot of their pros say they can break their gloves in in a week or two. Obviously, they're playing a lot more catch than I am. But still, you know, they also have, like, machines available to them at all times. And essentially, it's their job to get gloves broken in. So, uh, yeah, I, um, you know, just want to keep you guys updated on this. Um, the form's coming along really great. This took about a month. This one was a little bit stiffer. Um, when this first came in, uh, when he shipped it, I'm not sure whether if it was the way he shifted or it got shifted in the box, but it did have a little bit of an awkward form to it. It had a, um, like a pretty pancaked form. Like it was shipped really uh, wide and oblong, um, but I was able to, I think, put a pretty good shape on it. Uh, it's got, you know, the U close, just that kind of going for it. Really just trying to get a little bit more roll to it. Um, but I would, you know, feel pretty comfortable catching a bullpen um, in this, like, you know, in front of someone that it mattered. So, I'm um, just playing a lot of catch, no hot water on this, um, a little bit of mallet on my own time. Uh, I, I like to mallet gloves. Uh, I like to do it a lot when I'm just, like, watching TV or something, or, like, today, I was, like, I was in bed sick all day today, uh, the past two days, I had the stomach virus, that's why I didn't post this yesterday, sorry, I was, uh, puking and shitting my brains out, so I was unable to post a video for you guys, but, you know, I'm getting over it now, so, uh, even today I was just like watching a documentary and I was, you know, hitting, hitting the pocket and you know, getting it as game ready as possible for him. So when I ship it back out, this will be a perfect gamer for him. So, um, on another note, um, you know, more videos will be coming out this week. Um, I know a lot of you guys have uh, been asking for new content, stuff like that. So we're really going to try to, um, bring some stuff out. We're also going to try to have some fun with it. Um, maybe do a challenge. Um, but we would need to wait to the spring for that. Um, I know people do like the jalapeno challenge and stuff like that, but in the glove community, that doesn't really make sense. Um, you know, like as far as like, what could we do? But, uh, I have an idea. I might do it. Um, I'd be like, I'd have to go out to a field. So we'd have to get a nice day and then like eat like a ghost pepper or something like that. Like something like super hot. Cause you know, like a jalapeno won't do anything to me or Marco. Um, and then like start BP. And then, like, as soon as I hit a dinger, I can uh, drink milk or something like that. Kind of, like, have some fun with it. Like, you know, set up a cone or something. I have to, like, throw and hit the cone from, like, far away. It would just be, you know, something fun for you guys. Definitely some more stuff, you know, geared towards the spring. Till then, um, I want to hear your guys' suggestions for short videos. I don't know if you guys know who uh, Yugo Pro is. Um, he's a former pro pitcher, and he a answers, like, short little questions. And the video is, like, three, four minutes long. So, um, if you guys want that, like, you know, like he talks about like, you know, arm development and stuff like that and like how to get scouted. So, um, you know, I'm going to be doing that video soon about like how I control my nerves, like stuff I do kind of pregame. Um, so I can, you know, answer some more questions like that. If not, I can come up with some of my own and if you guys like it, you know, we'll keep it as a series. If not, you know, we'll get rid of it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for some big stuff coming up this week and some new stuff on our channel for the off season. Until next time, have a good day.